John's、uh, effect generator. Uh, Pentagon. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. So we back to one. So this machine is actually is not optimized, and there is great deal of potential that could be improved. Johnson effect generator is is very we heard of it, but we have never seen. Or we might, we can, we have a real unit that is operating is never been seen before. So we look at the possibility of compounding material, which is such as copper, plastic, aluminium, which is. Not is not itself powered by an output source, a compounding material. Just laying them on top of each other. This is a compound. This is one of the closest things. Excuse me. Closest things you can you can get on your hand. They put it onto a fan by compounding different elements, such as in this case metal and aluminium. In this instance, metal carry a positive charge, aluminium carry a negative charge. In theory, positive. Negative, positive, negative. We look into more detailed of it. Positive and negative. Positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. In all instance, we look into more detail of this. Of this never been seen before. Core. Does it magnet? Does it? Does it carry? Does it magnetize it? It is not magnetized. But the lighter color is aluminium. The darker color, in order to produce the darker color, is raw iron. In order to produce this core, it will be out of reach for so many people. Maybe there is bronze in the middle. We are not sure. It it encased in a metal shell. So when the whole things, we will look into more detail. When the whole things, it's a John Sird effects models, a beautiful working models. We will look into the core. In more detail, the core is obviously magnetized. Uh, 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 obviously, iron contain iron. So, it has iron. Positives and negatives are set up. It is all done by induction. Is a beautiful working John Sears models. So compounding material. Well,、uh, it jumped out of my hand. The spin when alternating current is around. So induction has got into this coil and turned this into a into a uh, and. Induction has magnetized enough the coil, allowing it to spin, self-regulating. It's just beautiful. These things, so simple, self-regulating, self-generating. But 
as I said, it's it's not in its op optimal. It's not optimized yet, but but the electricity electron does not like this setup. It heat up dramatically, and uh, you have to provide a effect reasonably two hundred household power in order for the inductions to take place and any multiplication of this given device or this part there's nearly no room to multiply it you cannot even loosen it it's it it will stay this way and this is a ordinary alternator AC currents just go in to the first part to provide north, provide north, and provide south, and that's it. So it heat up dramatically. The 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 RPM, the spin, the speed is not that dramatic, so it's not efficient. It's, uh, but it proved the concepts very well. Never seen before. It's so elegant. A John Sir, a working John Sir defects model. I cannot believe it. So, to further investigate, probably these fans need to need to be cut off. And uh, but the most valuable part is this compounded. And this compounded core never so elegant. I need my look at it closely. Now, you see it. You would be you would be dreaming that you could cr create one of these in your lab. No, you cannot. This one is custom made. Maybe this is a coil, compressed it, compounded and then chopped it. It's all worked by induction. Fascinating. See, there's no positive negative lead into it. It's a brushless alternating motor. This is how cutting edge this is. Unbelievable. Now, how do we wind it? It's not that simple. I don't know. It does not need alternating current. It could use our uh, standard coil, and we would have a this. We would have the very interesting result. So, so if you are uh, never heard of John Sir and wanting to get your hand on one of the John Sir defect generator, there is your chance. Plus, you would have a beautiful core, such an alien technology.